So this question is a translate word problem. And what I mean by that is, first of all, it's a long question, right? So anything that is greater than three lines long, I typically will categorize as translate word problem. Second of all, what we want to do, there's an approach here. The approach here is to read only a sentence at a time, um, making sure to either stop and make sure we understand it and or write down any quantitative or um, categorical information that will help us not need to reread the question at the end, right? That's the key. We don't want to have to reread this question multiple times. So let's get started. So the question says the posted weight limit for a covered wooden bridge in Pennsylvania is 6,000 pounds. So there's the first sentence. So 6,000 pound limit is my translation. The next sentence, a delivery truck that is carrying X identical boxes, each weighing 14 pounds, will pass over the bridge. All right, so I have a truck. I'm going to just draw, yeah, it doesn't have to be a great looking truck and really doesn't matter. Um, but this here's my truck. So I know that uh, I have X identical boxes on this truck and they're all 14 pounds. I'm just going to put, here's a box. I'm going to put a 14 inside and I'm going to say I have X boxes, right? So I don't know how many boxes I have. If the combined weight of the empty delivery truck and its driver is 4,500 pounds. So I have a 6,000 pound limit. The truck by itself is 4,500 pounds. Sorry, the truck with its driver um, is 4,500 pounds, which means that, right, if I find the difference between these two things. So here's where all the work happens, by the way. It's all in the in-between and understanding and translating. I have 1,500 pounds left that can be attributed to the X number of boxes at 14 pounds each. All right, so let's keep going. So then it says, so 4,500 pounds, what is the maximum possible value for X, right? So the number of boxes that will keep the combined weight of the truck, driver, and boxes below the bridge's posted weight limit. All right, well, I've already done the math and I know that I only have 1,500 pounds to work with. So if I have, if each box is 14 pounds and I don't know how many boxes I have, I can say that 14x, right, 14 times x has to be less than or equal to 1,500, right? That's my translation for what this question is really asking me. Um, so when I do the math on that, I can divide both sides by 14. And then in my calculator, I can take 1,500 divided by 14. And what I get here is that X has to be less than or equal to 107.14, which means that, right, if the question is asking for the, what do I want? Maximum possible value of X, that means that that maximum number of boxes is 107, right? Because that'll get me right bel below that 1500 mark. So 107 is the best answer here based upon the information provided.